Hello, welcome back to Rivo Tech. Today we've got the comparison of the PC and Stadia. They're both running in 1080p, both running on the PC. Obviously, PC games are on the PC. Stadia games are running through Chrome browser. Both running on 5 gigahertz Wi-Fi. Not that that makes much difference to the PC. But yeah, for Stadia, obviously it will. Uh, PC specs got a Ryzen 5 3600X, a 1060 6 gig graphics card and 16 gig of RAM in single channel. This video took quite a long time to edit, so if you drop a like, that would be very much appreciated. And subscribe for more content, drop a comment below on which you think looks better, and I'd highly suggest you watch this in full screen. Right, so in grid on the PC now, so we've got all the information up there, FPS and whatever else you could imagine is there. Uh, settings are on. Pretty much, yeah, everything's literally maxed out. So, right, I'll set it up so it's exactly the same as Stadia. See how it looks. Right, so we're in Stadia. I've got all the information up with as much as I can. Uh, ignore some of them drop frames. It's when you click on and off it, back in and out of it, that disrupts it. But obviously, you're not going to do that while you're playing. Um, options on this, we have literally brightness and that's it but okay i don't know why they don't let us have more control than that but yeah right i'll set it up exactly the same as i've just done with the pc version and we'll see how we go Right, we're in Far Cry 5 now on the Google Stadia, so let's see what options we've got. I'm guessing there's not much. Uh, audio and video, uh, and it's pretty much all just audio options. Yeah. Right, let's see what the actual gameplay looks like. Right, so we're in Far Cry 5 PC. Let's see what settings we've got for this. Pretty sure everything's on high video. Right, so yeah, everything's in high, not ultra for this, because it's a bit more of a demanding game than the other two. Right, let's see what they compare like. It's crawling with you. Now listen. 
Listen up. If you're gonna build a resistance, there's some things you need to know. And help any folks. I've got cameras set up all over this island. I'll keep an eye out for anything useful. For now, head south and take out any culture you see. And help any folks in need, would you? Don't you? to be a hero, but come on! Thanks, Deputy. These loony fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away. Browser in Destiny 2, the only FPS counter like stuff I can get is that little tiny one in the top right corner because Bungie decided to block MSI Afterburner. Uh, so this is running on the PC and everything is maxed out just to keep it consistent. So graphics quality, the highest. And it does look very, very good to be honest, right? So I'll come to the same place and stay here as well. Let's see what it looks like. Right, we're now in Destiny 2 on the stadia. Uh, let's have a look at the settings. We've got. Yeah, just brightness again. Right, let's see what it looks like. Get me closer to that antenna. Alright, so that's all the comparisons done. Uh, let me know what you think, if I could improve this video in any way. Um, personally, I think the PC does look better, but I think, to be fair, the Stadia probably would be on par with it if I was using it downstairs on the 4K TV, plugged in via Ethernet. But yeah, let me know what you think. Drop a like, really appreciated.
and subscribe for more.